So welcome Dune Rider, Chris Randall from realrawresults.com. Got it. Quick interview here, we're in New York City, just come back from Woodstock Fruit Festival, we had crazy post Woodstock Fruit Festival party week. <laughs> I think we've both had crazy late nights. Chris has been driving me around doing talks and stuff like that and uh, it's been a great week. So I thought I'd do a quick interview before we both leave New York City about Chris's uh, halved his body weight. Lost over 150 pounds. He's only 19 years old, so he's starting early. Yeah. So you've got a YouTube channel up, so Real Raw Results. Yeah, you got youtubecom slash Real Raw Results. Three R's, Real Raw Results. I'll put a link down below. Yeah. What got inspired you to uh, to get healthy and fit? The very first thing that inspired me was just looking in the mirror and not liking what I was seeing day in day out, and not getting the results that I wanted. Just being you know, fat, apathetic, not wanting to really participate in my life, just not enjoying what I was doing, not yeah. enjoying how I was feeling or looking, anything. And so, it's just like, something's got to change. You know, doing the same thing over and over every single day doesn't make any sense, especially if I'm looking for, you know, it's not working for me. It's not giving me mm. the results that I want. So, that just instantly, without even knowing what the word vegan meant, just intuitively, common sense, you know, brought me to low-fat vegan diet eating a lot of rice, potatoes, pasta, things like that in the very start. And then from there, that brought me to where I'm at now for yep. over two years on uh, 80 10 10 fruits and veggies. Nice. And I've been loving it ever since. And the way just effortlessly melted off. Once once I changed the foods that I was eating, yeah. you know, it, I didn't have to count, you know, like think like, oh, am I getting too many calories? Am I doing this? Am I, you know, having to restrict, put your fork down in between bites to try to fool yourself and thinking you're hungry and none of that crap was necessary. It was just, it's, uh, I just ate until just before I vomited and yeah. did that for two and a half, three years and over the course of then, I uh, lost 150 pounds of fat. Nice. It's never coming back. Nice. So you, you got, you felt initially when you did the, the high carb, like the rice and vegan style, yeah. that worked as well? That, that yeah. works fantastic. Yeah. And like, I was eating, you know, more fruits and vegetables than, fresh fruits and vegetables than most people would think mm -hmm. is proper, but I was still eating just mat, like kilos of pounds and pounds of cooked rice and mm -hmm. potatoes and stuff like that. And I highly recommend that for people who, for whatever reason, you know, whatever their reason might be, they don't want to do raw, yep. you know, just get on the vegan program and just knock back the starch. It's preferably gluten-free, I yep. think, optimally, but, yeah, yeah. you know, rice, potatoes, yams, gluten-free pasta, quinoa, amaranth. So you know, anything doc, like that. Dr. McDougall doc, style. Dr. McDougall yeah. style, yeah. Just, you know, you get crazy good results with that, too. You know, fruit, uh, raw fruit and veg is definitely the best, but you're still just going to be loving it on yeah. the starches. Yeah, that's, that's what I'll definitely promote as well. Yeah. It's, uh, starch is a good backup plan, but fruits, fruits is the win. But it, we see a lot of people get uh, carried away with, just, you know, they can't do something 100%, they just give up. Go back to KFC. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like someone does a, does a, run, a marathon and their shoelace comes undone, but they don't want to stop and fix their shoelace because they think they'll be quitting. So they, they, they keep running until they trip over. Yeah. It's, it's just stop through your shoelace and get back on, on the program. Mm -hmm. um, which one, some of these black wasps around here. There's about 20 black wasps behind the computer. He does it around. It's pretty surreal. I'm not sure what they're doing. They never seem to stop. No. So, and what about your friends and family? What do they say about this the crazy diet you're eating? Um, I think it's... I'm pretty crazy, but uh, especially at first when people, you know, they're, they're worried about you, they're like, oh, are you getting enough protein, enough calcium, enough whatever, you know, they weren't worried about that when I was eating steak and eggs and Twinkies, yep. are you getting too much cholesterol, are you getting too much saturated fat, you know, you're unhealthy, you're overweight, you think maybe you're getting too much of something, not enough of something else, so it's kind of funny how that works when you start eating fruits and vegetables, people start worrying about yep. your health, but, you know, it's, uh, what you really just have to go by is by example, you know, it's like my friends and family kind of thought I was crazy but now I'm that guy who feels really good all the time actually goes out running because he enjoys it <laughs> you know is happy is healthy I don't you know want to take a nap at 3, 3 p.m. every single day like most people do and people respect that you know and I'm the guy I'm still the fun uh, I'm the fun guy I can go out and go to music concerts with my friends and do anything yeah. but I'm not bringing bongs and Doritos to the concert I'm bringing yeah. 20 pounds of watermelon with me <laughs> and uh and so it's just making lifestyle work for you and just being the example and doing it. And, you know, people see the results and they can't deny it. Yeah. You know? So people tell me, it's like, you know, Chris, you're totally right in this whole vegan, you know, fruit and veg thing. It's like, you're totally right on and I see it working, but I'm just not willing to do what you do. 
I just not willing to do it. And that's fair enough. You know, people come around at their own time and they want it all, but I'm just gonna always gonna have that helping hand up. Definitely. Uh, to lift them up, but not necessarily going to be attached to their outcome. Yeah. That's the sound advice, man. We'll wrap it up here, keep it short and sweet, but I'll put Chris's YouTube video link down below, so if you want more information, check out this guy, because people always say, Harley, you haven't ever had a weight issue, but people like Chris have, and they've gotten results in this high-carb, vegan fruit thing. It works, 100%. Absolute car pouring every single day. <laughs> it's just like, not... I, people literally, to this day, they still tell me I should be insidiously overweight by the amount of carbohydrates yeah. and simple sugars that I eat every yeah. single day. I haven't seen it happen. Yeah. Yet. You know, it's just the people that I coach, it's working for them. You just got to do it. You know, it's not just me. I'm not special. I'm not, you know, doing any weird stuff on the side. It's just healthy eating. It's just healthy fruits and vegetables. And if people work the program, it works for them. As much as you want. As much as you want, eat fruit.